a drink is being born. I think that coffee is one of the most wonderful things on the planet. It's not pushing buttons, it's a craft. Customers would ask me, what are you gonna do next? And I'd be like, what do you mean, I'm a barista? Yeah, chosen profession. If you would have told me eight years ago that I was gonna be a competitive barista, I would have laughed in your face. It's like best in show, but for coffee. You're in an arena preparing 12 drinks within 15 minutes. A barista must prepare three rounds of drinks, espresso, cappuccino, and the signature drink, serving it in any method they can dream up. I have huge ideas. I decided I would customize a jam. I had just a really simple visual metaphor, white chocolate, lime wedges, vanilla beans, peanuts, dried peppers, rocks. Gosh. It's so awesome. You run through an incredible amount of bad ideas. I've done bacon fat mochas. You're like, this is gross. This is gross. I have bacon fat in my mustache right now. I had this idea to distill coffee. The mad scientist on stage can go epically wrong. Are you able to continue Facebooking while I'm making ice cream? They're timing all of your espresso shots. There's a drop of water on the grill. You lose a point for that. There's a lot of pressure. The adrenaline is so high that I kind of blacked out. I looked down and there was literally no foam in my pitcher. It was at that moment that I realized I was done. It's difficult to make a living at it. You walk away with the same paycheck as if you were slinging a McDouble. Winning changes your life as a barista. You do really well and you can get all kinds of investment opportunities from it. Whoops. Competition is a sport. Your performance is a sport. I had nothing ready on the cart. We were running back and forth, and we ran out of time. Once they say your practice time is done, you're done. When you're down there, you're all alone. And what you're capable of, even if you're the best, is somebody better than you. Make some noise for the winner of the USBC. If I sketched a Ghostbuster, it would be the silliest. I might sketch a Ghostbuster next year. The search for the female lead in Star Wars Episode 8 has reportedly been narrowed to three. For all the details, click on more news.